it's time for an intense keyboard competition for under $100. But this time, we can only use AliExpress. Squashy boy, I challenge you to build the best keyboard you can from AliExpress. Knowing Squashy, he's always doing weird things with engineering or programming some random stuff. So I know I have to do the best. You overestimated what I could do. <laughs> <laughs> okay, here we are again. AliExpress. 1111, I heard this is like the Asian Black Friday. What a sale! Keyboard kit. Ooh, what do we have here? This one's only $12. There's no way. Oh, never mind. It's actually 70. Nice. That's a scam. I need to find something cheap. Here's one. This one's $34 to 52. Now how do I get that $34 thing? White is cheaper than black. So I'm gonna go for the white one. Look, it has a knob. People like knobs. And hot swap this is perfect. Add to cart. Now I need switches. Hmm, there's some good options here. But they're too expensive. I need something cheap. These Echo CS switches, I've heard they're really good. And for 90 pieces, it's only $25. That's perfect. I want the best sounding one. This one, the red one. Maybe I should read about it first. No, no. Add the cart. Now for the best part, keycaps. In my wish.com video, I lost because my keycaps were too basic. I need something full of pizzazz. Keycaps. <laughs> hmm, looks like everything here is a knockoff. I need to find something that's real. If I buy some of these clone sets, people are gonna destroy me on Twitter and in the comments, and I can't have that. This looks real. Mars green two color PBT keycaps. For 126 keys, it's only $31. Is that good? That yeah, seems good. Add to cart. Now for the last thing. <laughs> Keyboard a lubricant. Ooh, here's some. It's only six dollars. There's no way this is the real stuff. Lubricating grease oil lube lubricant for mechanical keyboard switch stem and OEM. What is this? Every word you can use to describe lube. Add to cart. And with lube, I need tools. Keyboard tools. Here it is. Lubing tools for only seven dollars. Add to cart. Perfect. The card says that it's $93.82, even with lube and tools. I hope I'm not gonna get scammed like Wish.com. Look at these shipping prices. My total is $94, but shipping is $40. Squashy doesn't have to worry about these atrocious shipping prices because he's literally right next to China. And it takes more than a month. What? I can't wait for all these things to arrive. Switch and Click merch is now live at shopswitchandclick.com. You can win a chance at getting a custom keyboard built by me. This is the KVD67 Lite, and you get to pick the switches of your choice. I will lube them, solder them into here, build the whole thing, and then send it to your doorstep. You can also win a chance to get your current keyboard, whether membrane or mechanical, upgraded fully by me and also sent to your doorstep. No matter how icky or dirty, I will do my best to make it beautiful and thocky. The Cats and Keyboard Switch shirt is my personal favorite. They are all super cozy, warm items for the winter. Shop merge now at shopswitchandclick.com by clicking the first link in the description. One eternity later. All the AliExpress parts are finally here, or at least I hope everything is here. Is there anything in here? Ta da! It's stuff wrapped in foam. There's two brushes. They're actually really high quality. I've got to say, everyone's making some intense profit selling these for $5 each. It doesn't feel greasy. It's very liquidy. Cute. Got a lot of lube in there. And this also says grease for a mechanical keyboard. We're looking at mystery oil and mystery grease. Can't wait to use them. Hmm. I know what's in here. Keycaps. Hope they look good. Ooh. These are pretty nice. And last, KFO 68. Slide. Ah, this is the one thing separating us from victory. Ooh, matcha green stabilizers. And a knob. I think it even has Bluetooth. What are these? Make sure your keyboard's cool. Air ventilation. 
I'm really impressed with everything I got from AliExpress, but I know Squashy is up to something crazy. It's time to start modding. all of the switches using that mystery lube that I got from AliExpress. Thickness. I ended up donut dipping the springs and applied a light coat to the switch stem only. As light as I possibly could. For the case, I ended up doing a silicone pour. Once it was done, it made the keyboard sound a lot better and added a hefty weight to it. Also, to my surprise, the keyboard came with plate foam between the plate and the PCB, so I didn't have to do any PE. Sorta of nice for being how cheap it is. wasn't an exact match, it added a lot of spice to my build. It was now time to reassemble the keyboard and once the keycaps were on, I was shocked by how amazing it looked. Everything came together perfectly. Phone call time. My actual keyboard is uh, kind of, it's kind of a disappointment. Is this? That doesn't look too bad. If I bring it closer to the camera, you can kind of see how the keys are. Oh. What happened there? Oh, this is a very ordinary keyboard actually. It's just a GH60 with uh, blue switches, OEM switches, and keycaps. It totaled $66 actually. <laughs> it's loud. Oh. It's really loud. Oh. <laughs> it's not it's that bad. bad. Yeah, that's that's my side. Let's see what you got. Boom! Ew. Well, that's nice. The stabilizer sounds so good. I know. I, I lost the moment I chose blue switch. So yeah, thanks for straight up wrecking me in this competition. So is there a prize? I don't know. You're the one that challenged me. Oh. You must it's, call me the better I... keyboard builder. <laughs> switch and click is the bad, 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 bad. Thank goodness I didn't get scammed this time around. But if you want to see me get scammed, I build a keyboard from Wish.com.